At almost 88 years old, it may be no surprise to spot Laureen Knight at a local retirement home. The surprising part is, she's only there to entertain the residents. I live in a two-bedroom trailer in Bruce Mines, yeah. Pretty well every week we come to one of the homes in the Sioux. I, I play with these guys every Thursday and, and sometimes at the VON uh, we, twice a month. And then I, there's another couple, Paul Disher and Jean Alcock. We play at Thessalon and Bruce Mine. And I play for church on Sundays. Oh, I, I want to do it as possibly as long as I can. As long as somebody will play with me, that's fine. It's been my life, yeah. In about 13 or 14, I started playing at the church service, just by ear with one finger. <laughs> And uh, I, I never had music lessons. I just learned by doing. They had, there was a piano in the house, and, but it was kind of off limits. And uh, I wasn't allowed to just go in and play it whenever I wanted to. And they all, it was always locked. So I decided one time I was home alone and I got my stepfather used to cut hair and he uh, had barber scissors with the long point. And I got the barber scissors and I unlocked the piano with them. And then from then on, when any time I'd be left alone, I would go in and just play away at it. And, but I always had to make sure I was out of there before anybody came home. Music was my life. My, my dad that I, I never knew, but he was very musical, he played the guitar and the violin. This is what I've been told. I never knew him myself, but... And uh, it's, I've just been into music. And I, I tried a little bit on the guitar, I tried a little bit on the violin, but I always went back to the piano. All the induction into the Country Music Hall of Fame, in, uh, I, I don't even remember the year, 2013, I think it was, because my husband passed away in 2011, and we were both inducted into the Hall of Fame. Yeah. And then I met George and Lawrence, and they've been supporting me ever since. <laughs> I've always been a kind of a an active person, and I I just. I just want to keep going. I feel once I give that up, then I'm done for. <laughs> I just want to keep doing. <laughs>